Hello, it's James Garrett, video trainer here from HNE Media. In today's video, I'm just going to show you something that will be really useful if you create podcasts and particularly useful if you want to create a podcast from a video that you've already um, filmed and edited, for example, as this will really save you um, time in having to sort of edit a separate audio file. Um, so just as an example, I've got uh, Open Mic UK here, um, which is a, a competition that we work on. And what I want to do is turn this video, essentially, that you can see here. As you can see, this is an audio layer here and also a video layer here. Um, but what, what I want to do is rather than export that as a video, I'm going to export that as an audio file. So in order to do this, it's the same as um, exporting a video. So go up to File. Go down to export and then media and then the bit that's different is up here under format you've got a couple of options um, you've got AAC which um, stands for advanced audio coding and this is generally a better quality um, audio and is, was designed to be a successor to the mp3 format so in terms of bit rate um, the audio quality um, is, is all round better, so you might want to choose um, AAC, for example. And another one you might want to look at is also Waveform Audio or .wav. We use this quite a lot um, when we're exporting audio uh, to, to play around with afterwards. So all you do is select that, um, click on Output Name. You want to save it somewhere where you'll be able to find it again. So we're going to save it back into here, give it a name that's obvious, click save and then just check that you've got your sequence into out settings correct. So you either want the entire sequence, um, sequence into out or the work area for the, for the bit that you're working on or you can customise it at the bottom there. But we're just going to go for entire sequence and then you can either queue or you can export depending on whether you want to export it straight away or whether you want to cure it. Um, being audio, it exports really, really quickly um, and will not take as long as a video because there isn't actually the video element to export. So if we were to export, there you go, that's done. Um, that was obviously only a four minute uh, piece of audio, but that was really, really quick. And now what you've got is an audio file that you can make use of. So again, as I say, if you're going to do a podcast um, or anything like that, you want audio from a video, you can actually capture the audio within the video, make the video, and then export the audio separately for other uses. So hopefully you found that helpful, and um, I'll see you on the next video.